Hey, make sure y'all drop a like, man. We are finna get into all these jump shots. The best jump shots in 2K23. Small guards, big guards, and you big center builds. I know y'all struggling. So Terrence Davis, a very easy jump shot two time. If you are a small guard and you're struggling to shoot, try this out and get back to me, man. Now look, I'm gonna give you a two for one with this jump shot. If you want to make it as fast as possible, you just make the animation blend in 100% Robinson, by the way, okay? Make sure y'all subscribe too, man. Help me hit 300K. You know, support your boy. Turn on them post notice. I should be dropping a gameplay vid today um, about a 6-7 build, so y'all be on the lookout for that. James Harden, okay? Nice jump shot, okay? Harden is, it's actually, the base is 6'10 and below. So you can use this and just the Oscar Robinson. You don't have to have a Steph Curry because you can't use Steph Curry when you're above 6'5. So, um, but this is just for the little guys out there. This is another good jump shot that you can shoot with. Test it out, man. Not all grades are the same, man. I'm just giving y'all a variety of options. But this is for the little guards. I'm, I'm gonna show you the big guards next. This, hold on, the 6'5 plus. But I'm showing you little little guard. Okay, that, that was like a 3'4, you know? Now I'm hearing people say this is jump shot 38, you know, for the little guards. Y'all remember jump shot 38 from uh 2K20? I think that someone told me this. I don't I don't remember. But um try this out. You want to use jump shot 38. It was always one of the fastest bases. Another 6-5 and under jump shot. My mind lost. You know, he he told me this is the uh fastest jump shot in the game. Apparently. I I I don't know, man. I haven't tested it out personally. I tested a lot of these jump shots and they they seem cash, but I heard this was the fastest jump shot in the game. So, you know, test it out. Let me know. 2K Lab, test this. Like, what's up? What's up? And here goes another jump shot that is very easy to time. You got A plus everywhere. Timing impact, man. Uh, like, it, it helps. But then at the same time, you know, it might not. Like, your base is more important than timing impact. You know, there's a bunch of hidden stats in there. But um, John Wall's a very good like jump shot to time. They said if your time and impact is high, well, not then. 2K Tuts put out a vid, and he said if you have a high time and impact compared to F, and say you get like an A plus or an A or something, he says it's like a 5% increase. So, you know, it's not as important as like portrayed, but... You know, it is a help, but the the base would override it if it's cash. Here's another cash small people jump shot, man. To check it out. I think you can do 610 with this too, with the John Wall. I'm gonna show y'all the best um shooting badges too, man. So just just be on the lookout. And also, bro, if you wanna shoot better, grind out your hot spots. I know 90% of people are not grinding out their hot spots. I just know, bro. A hundred percent. A hundred percent. Now this jump shot is green as hell, especially on current gen. By the way, all these jump shots work for both gens. Um, it's green as hell. It's just so easy to time, bro. It's a, another six ten and under jump shot, and um, test it out, bro. Like, yeah, <laughs> it. This, this. I don't know, man. This might be one of the best uh, jump shots I've ever used. You know, test it out. Come back to me, man. If you want it to be as fast as possible, again, you can just make it 100% Oscar. In fact, we're gonna go back to those old jump shots because I forgot to give y'all different variations too. Now, Kobe Bryant, um, two variations, 100% Oscar Robinson, and um, this custom jump shot right here. Another butter jump shot, bro. You know, I'm giving y'all options, man. Everyone I play verse, especially in rec. In rec, y'all cannot shoot. Not y'all. Most people cannot shoot. Probably you find in this video, you can't shoot either. Uh, especially no squad 3v3s. Most people are randoms, bro. Like, and even in the park... Like, most people can't shoot, bro. 
<laughs> this is it's crazy. Even in 2K22, most people could not shoot, bruh. It that is crazy as hell. That that was the easiest shoot in 2K ever. And people could still not shoot. Now here is a 610 jump shot, bro. I have not used a 610 plus. I have not used this, but you know, I hear it's nice. Okay. Here is another 610 jump shot. Again, I have not tried this, but I hear it's nice, man. You got nice grades. Y'all let me know uh y'all's favorite jump shot down below too. What actually works for you, you know, help people out. Here goes another jump shot, the Chris Bosch. Now, if you don't want to 100%, you know, you could do this. Here's another variation of the uh, Lori. It's supposed to be like the fastest jump shot. Or, you know, you could do something like this. But it ain't going to be as fast. Also, make sure you use very late and uh, no shot meter, bro. It'll help you out a lot. Trust me. Okay, look. Here are the best shooting badges in general, bro. Okay, I don't have my shooting max on this build, but I'm going to just show y'all something. Agent 3's is the best badge for main ball handlers, okay? The best badge, okay? Bar none. It's not just fading. It's not just pull-ups, bro. It's stopping uh, pop. It's everything. Every shot you take while, like, moving rhythm shooter, it's all combined into this badge. So if you are a main ball handler, put this shit on max. Bar none, bro. Okay, um, even catch and shoot when you're a main ball handler, you want this, bro, because you can shoot it instantly. And like, even with the fade shot, your catch and shoot's gonna pop up and the agent threes, and then you could catch them holes even more. Everyone is leaving everyone open, bro. Okay, like all levels, bro, like, especially when they think you're like drained of adrenaline and all that catch and shoot it, it changes your game completely bro especially if you are bad bro uh amped you know eh, you know they they say it reduces the penalty it, it's it's cool bro um and then claymore when you spot when when you're spotting up you catch the ball and you wait and then you shoot this is more for spot ups but still this is still a good thing for a main ball handler you see i got it low and then the volume shooter i'm gonna eventually max out because you know it helps with every shot but limitless range you don't even need bro because of the limitless takeover i'm gonna show you bro look i can keep shooting from half court with this badge with the uh with the damn near seven seven what, what was my three point like a 76 three bro I can shoot from half court just with this badge on single, like the single takeover. And you can shoot from everywhere. So you can save badge points without um, even having limitless on. You know, it's still a good badge. It works. It's, it's a great badge. But if you have like accelerator and just limitless, you can just hit from limitless. So you can save badge points and be smart. I got a bunch of clips, bro, of a... Uh, me hitting from limitless the dead eye ugh, you know it, it ain't it ain't that it ain't it ain't what it used to be blinder same thing corner they say don't work some people say it do work green machine they say it activate after the third shot until i hear otherwise so it's not really as needed guard up some people say don't even work um space creator all dependent to your style and many but yeah your main badges that you want as a main ball handler, Agent 3's amped, catch and shoot. And then you start to, you know, the volume shooter, then the Claymore, and then everything else is all dependent on you. Now for a spot up, bro, you want catch and shoot max, Claymore max. I don't, I, I'm not, I'm not too, I don't, I don't, I don't know about guard up, bro. For a spot up, you could do something like this, bro. Really, for a spot up, it's really like the same badges, bro. It, it really is, because they say uh, corner specialists don't work. It's really like the same badges, man, to be honest. Now, maybe, uh, I don't know about this dead eye and blinders, bro. I don't know, bro. I, I haven't been made a believer. A lot of people make a lot of tweets and stuff, but I, I, I just haven't seen it. You can shoot crabs. People think it's blinders. You can shoot crabs without blinders and it be OP. Like, I don't think people are noticing a big difference from making it gold to uh, 
you know i don't know bro basically between spot ups and um main ball handlers is you're just going to want to have clay more and catch and shoot more that's basically it bro to to keep it a hundred and of course these are going to be your main shit you know the catch and shoot and the clay more but you want to be able to fade and sometimes the game makes you fade so you want to have this badge on still this will be your third badge as a spot up that you will need and um y'all yeah. be sure to follow me on twitch man link is in the description make sure y'all go to the gym eight days a week drink a gallon of water a day and click on one of these two videos but hey hey here we go again yeah. here we go again people talking this but when this hit the fan everything i'm that made me now break it down yo off the top of the dome dome